you do not need to own an indiscriminate serial killer slash invasive species slash ecological nightmare, otherwise known as a cat, to manage a mouse or rat problem. Please share this video with anyone who thinks you do. Here are tips for keeping mice and rats away from your home and garden. Repair pierced sewer lines or add backflow valves of the normally closed type to the lines leading from basement plumbing fixtures. These are perfect access points for sewer rats. Install metal weather stripping under doors and make sure windows are well caulked. Seal any cracks you find in the foundation. Seal all joints around pipes. Use fine mesh metal screens to cover dryer vents, fan intakes and outlets, and roof vents. Keep your kitchen clean. Store dry foods including pet food in metal or glass containers. Cut back tall grass around the house so you don't provide nesting sites for rodents. For the same reason, remove clutter around the building. Keep garbage in bins with tight-fitting lids. If you have wood stacked outside, make sure it is around 30 cm 1F off the ground and away from the house. Don't put fatty or oily table scraps, eggs or dairy products in the compost bin, unless it is a sealed model. Line the bottom of the bin with a solid, fine mesh metal screen. Eliminate sources of water around the house, leaky taps, flower pots, etc. When the weather first turns cold in the fall, keep your doors properly closed. At this time of year, rodents will be actively seeking warm places. How to get rid of a rat or mouse infestation? Traps can be effective if laid in the right locations. The classic snap trap is best rather than glue traps which are less humane because the rodents survive for a time. You can also use food laced with an anticoagulant rodenticide commonly known as rat poison, which kills rats and mice and causes their carcasses to dry up. Be careful, though these types of poison are hazardous to children and pets. If you opt for a baited trap, use strong smelling foods like peanut butter or bacon drippings mixed with oat flakes, raisins or gumdrops. Reset traps to 2-3 weeks after the most recent captures to catch newly matured young. Check the traps every day, regardless of which model you use, protection is a must. When cleaning areas soiled by rodents, with soap and water, always wear rubber gloves and a HEPA filter mask. If you are dealing with a colony or need to eliminate one or more brown rats, hire a professional, an authorized exterminator must have a permit. See link in the description for tips on how to choose one wisely. If you suspect that rats are living beneath your home's foundation slab, camera inspection of the drains may be necessary. Drain inspection specialists and some plumbers offer this service. 